The first one will be elastic modules, a very simple procedure which all of you probably do on a daily basis in Baccal Orthodontics. But we will show you a few tips and tricks how to do it with these miniature brackets which are very small and sometimes in the mouse we need some accessories in order to ligate it properly. So let's see the hands-on on elastic modules. Uh, to do the uh, elastic modules ligation First of all, we are preparing the uh, mushroom wire, which can be passive, it can be active if we want to procline, we want to expand. Now, what I usually do in the mouse, I start from uh, putting an elastic module on the posterior uh, teeth. I use uh, elastic models which are very small. Uh, can be bought by many uh, manufacturers and then we go to one of the posterior teeth and ligate the wire then I do the same in the other premolar You go from one wing to the other like a square until the wire is nicely secured in the slot. Now, as you can see, now the wire is crocklined so I can safely cut with a distal cutter in the mouse, of course. I can cut the excess of the wire because usually that disturbs the patient and now I can continue with the ligation and finish uh, the work once uh, uh, finish cutting the edges once we finish so now I will take the wire a little distally to fit into the slot another two useful tools that I use uh, is the uh, ligature director which is 45 degrees uh, to fit for lingual then in the mouse I guide the wire deep into the slot and the second is an explorer which is round in order to have more access to the lingual side and then I guide the uh, elastic, the elastic module and then with the explorer I put it under the wing and then above the upper wing very simple, very easy, and very useful. I now go back to the premolar. There are uh, two wings, one mesial and one distal. So I can decide to tie it on all the four wings or only on the mesial or only on the distal. Once I have completed the ligation, you can see now that I have small wire over here and bigger wire over here. Now I can use of course the distal cutter but as I will show you now even if you get close to the uh, bracket the as you will see here after I cut the wire there is still little little wire that is extending uh, distally to the uh, terminal bracket now this wire definitely will poke the patient uh, tongue 
what can we do now? We can either use a regular ligature cutter, as I will show you here, or I can use a diamond bear. Usually I use a flame shape and then slowly, uh, gently cut the excess of the wire and if needed replace the elastic here because sometimes the elastic is torn by the uh, bear.